I just got back from the grocery store. I just bought a few things, but I figured I would share it. I got a nice big watermelon. I got some mushrooms, and I just recently started eating mushrooms, so I'm not really sure if there's like one mushroom that's healthier than the other, but I usually get um, the Baby Bella kind. So let me know if you know anything about that. Got some kale here, some parsley, so I'm probably going to juice uh, both of these tomorrow for a little juice. Uh, some lemon as well with the juice and some ginger. I got some strawberries that were on sale and some bananas. I'm so bad when it comes to grocery shopping sometimes. Usually I'll get to the grocery store and be so organized. I don't need a list. I know exactly what I need. I get it in like under 10 minutes and I'm out of there. But some days I go into a grocery store and I literally forget how to grocery shop. I'm just like, what am I doing? And then I leave and this always happens. Five minutes after I leave and I'm on the road, I forget that I probably should have gotten bananas, all these things. I'm like, why didn't I get that? So um, that happened today, but that's okay because there's a fresh market right next to me. So I went to the fresh market and got some stuff. The only thing is that uh, their stuff is way too expensive for me. Uh, so that's why I only got like two bananas because I'm like, I'll just get three and hold off till I can get back to Trader Joe's. So yeah, I am chilling in my apartment because all my friends are busy tonight. I was going to um, hang out with my best friend, but he has to work tonight. So I'm chilling in my apartment, and it is so bare. There's a random picnic cloth there. <laughs> because my roommate has moved out, and she pretty much had all the furniture. So I'm just chilling here by myself. And um, if you read my latest blog post, you know that I'm kind of in limbo right now trying to figure out the next step. But I have a few more weeks here in this apartment. And in the meantime, I'm just trying to figure it all out, which, you know, like I kind of was saying, my blog post is really super scary, super stressful because I don't really know what I'm doing with my life. You know, that like after college thing that happens. You're like, oh my God, what am I doing? Uh, that's kind of happening, even though it's been a year since I've graduated. <laughs> that's okay. Uh, so yeah, even though it's really kind of scary and stressful, it's also really exciting. It's just a, an opportunity for to meet new people and for new opportunities to happen. And you know, as cheesy as this quote is, when one door closes, another door opens. And I've kind of been experiencing going through a really hard thing for a long time one of my best friends has just really changed and i had always pictured my life with him and um, unfortunately things have really shifted and changed and now i have to figure out what i'm doing because i had always envisioned my life with him so that's okay though because like i said i don't know why i'm going in circles here uh, <laughs> that's okay because something good is coming whenever you're not you know when you're on the, on the, the down slope and everything just seems horrible you know something's good something good is headed your way you just have to keep thinking positively and uh, you know I think a lot of times we tell ourselves well it could be worse but honestly it could always be worse there's always something that's going to be worse than your situation so I think it's okay for you to really like be upset and be, you know, feel what you're feeling and go through what you're going through because it's totally valid and, you know, you don't have to push it away by saying, well, it could be worse. It could always be worse. But I do think it's also important to keep thinking positively and um, to not sit into, oh, my life sucks. So <laughs> I hope you have a nice day and I hope you had a nice like 360 tour of my apartment that has literally nothing in here. <laughs> Anyways, I will see you guys later. Bye.